U.S. Secretary of State Mike Pompeo announced that there is a real opportunity for a denuclearized North Korea after a historic meeting with Kim Jong-un as he warned a military response was still on the table. Today Mr. Pompeo revealed he was able to get a better read on Kim and that there is a real opportunity the despotic leader could be prepared to do something that is historic and different. Mr. Pompeo added the U.S. administration has its eyes wide open and the option of a military response was still on the table if North Korea continued to threaten the U.S. The Secretary of State, who was sworn into the Trump administration on Thursday, said the pair were able to negotiate in a way that has been done before. Mr. Pompeo said, I think it's a big deal. It is important, every step along the way matters. The objective remains the same, complete, verifiable, irreversible denuclearization. That has been the administration's goal. Anytime you get the chance to meet face-to-face -face with someone, you get a better read about what they're thinking, whether they're really prepared to do something that is historic and different. My goal was to try and identify if there was a real opportunity there. I believe there is. Who knows how the ultimate discussions will go? There is a lot of work to do, but I am very hopeful that the conditions that have been set by President Trump, however when pressed by ABC News Chief White House Correspondent Jonathan Carl about whether the U.S. can trust anything that comes out of a meeting with Kim Jong-un, Mr. Pompeo replied, This administration has its eyes wide open. We know the history. We know the risks. G-E-T-T-Y USA v North Korea, Mike Pompeo warns military response still an option after meeting Kim Jong-un, we're going to negotiate in a different way than has been done before, the former CIA director continued, I don't know which way it will go, as the president has said, only time will tell. An obligation to engage in diplomatic discourse to try and find a peaceful solution so that Americans aren't held at risk by Kim Jong-un and his nuclear arsenal. Kim Jong-un is going to have to make a decision. Does he want the pressure campaign against North Korea to continue? The objective remains the same. Complete, verifiable, irreversible denuclearization of North Korea U.S. Secretary of State Mike Pompeo. Or is he looking for something big and bold and different, something that hasn't happened before? The meeting took place over Easter before the former CIA director was officially sworn in as Secretary of State, replacing Rex Tillerson who was sacked by President Trump last month. The U.S. president confirmed Mr. Pompeo's meeting on Twitter and last week released pictures of the summit. Mr. Trump tweeted, Mike Pompeo met with Kim Jong-un in North Korea last week, meeting went very smoothly and a good relationship was formed. G-E-T-T-Y USA v North Korea, Mike Pompeo announced that there is a real opportunity for North Korea Jadusa v North Korea, Donald Trump plans to meet Kim Jong-un, details of summit are being worked out now, denuclearization will be a great thing for world, but also for North Korea, speaking with the American morning talk show Fox. Personalities were not supposed to meet but Mr. Trump added, he, you know, they arranged actually while he was there, to say hello, G-E-T-T-Y USA v North Korea, Kim Jong-un has been told be must denuclearize or face a U.S. military strike you and asked to clarify what, hello, meant, he explained that Mr. Pompeo and Kim's meeting went on for one hour and had a good outcome. The U.S. administration is currently working to arrange a meeting between Mr. Trump and Kim in the upcoming weeks. Mr. Trump on Friday rejected criticism that he could be played by Kim, who he plans to meet with in the coming weeks. The U.S. president said, we're not going to be played, okay? We're going to hopefully make a deal, if not that's fine. 